Okay, so now we're going to go with the, uh, the second oldest one here. Since I have three CD books, this is the middle one, if you will. And quite frankly, it's probably my favorite one. It's big, it's bulky, and the pockets are definitely a lot bigger. So, uh, yeah, here is a Morphus right here. Tales of the Thousand Lakes, Elegy, Tuanella, Um Universum, Far From the Sun. And there's some, uh, I know that album's kind of eh, but there are some really good songs on that one. Then we get to the Tommy Utsun years, Eclipse, Silent Waters, Skyforger, Beginning of Time, Circle. So, yeah, definitely my favorite singer from uh, Amorphous. He's represented on these five albums here. Here's Alce or Alcest, or however you say it. Um, of course, that's their um, album from 2012. And that's a shelter from just this year. Here's uh, Anathema right here. I'm looking forward to their newest one. Arion right here. Um, I picked it up because Hansi Korsh from Blind Guardian, Daniel Ginlau from Pain of Salvation, and Jonas Vengse from Catatonia, of course, all appear on this album. And that's really, really cool. Baroness right here with yellow and green. Here's a Bathory, Hammerheart. Uh, here's a Beyond the Bridge by The Old Man and the Spirit. And I feel bad that the keyboard has actually died like shortly after this album came out. So rest in peace. But yeah, a really good album regardless. Here's a By Locate right here. Pretty decent. Um, here's a Blind Guardian, of course. Uh, going all the way up there. I mean, I have the other albums too, but I've downloaded those. These are the only physical ones I have. And the space is reserved for... Like, they said something about releasing a new studio album and then releasing, like, an orchestral album. So, I'm looking forward to getting those two whenever they do that. It's taking forever. Here's a Caligula right here. It's not a... This is a DVD, actually, with Malcolm McDowell. It's pretty crazy, but I love it. Here's a Celtic Frost Monotheist. Here's a Circus Maximus Nine. The Cult with Love, Dark Tranquility. Your um, like images and words used to be right here, but I sold it to get uh, one of the Coldplay albums, uh, specifically Rush of Blood to the Head. So, images and words is no longer there, though I've kept the MP3, and I'm gonna sell that pretty soon since I like that even less than images and words. I don't know, I've kind of just been bored of Dream Theater, so as soon as I find the case, I'm actually gonna sell that one. Sorry. Um, here's a uh, Deftones right here, Coin No You'll Gone. Here's the, the legendary deal right there. Same there. Edge of Sanity right here. Here's Purgatory Afterglow and the legendary Crimson 1 and Crimson 2. So, um, yeah, great albums. These are perfect tens right here. Just amazing. Emerson Lake and Palmer, their first one. Emperor right here. I have the solo project in the other one. There's uh, Prometheus. Avenue right here. Decent, like, gothic folk album. Here's the other Exhausted Prayer album I got. Um, I showed you one in the other CD case. This is the first one that I got. Fate's Warning right here. Here's the Parallels, Inside Out, and uh, Disconnected. Uh, here's Genesis right here, Trespass, uh, Nursery Crime. All, basically, all the Peter Gabriel albums barring from Genesis to Revelation. I even have a Trick of the Tail right here. Definitely see a music, uh, the musical box when they come by your area. They're just fantastic. Love Genesis. Um, here's House of Spirits right here. Pretty cool, like a uh, prog metal act. Um, I think uh, their vocalist sounds a bit cheesy, but the music itself is actually really good. And uh, his voice can work in moments. Um, here's uh, Isis Panopticon and Wavering Radiant right here. Some post-metal. And uh, here's Catatonia right here of Dance of December Souls. I, of course, have every Catatonia album that there is, since I'm a major fan. I even have the poster right there, which I've uh, shown you in many videos, including stickers and stuff. But here's, um, yeah, all the albums, of course. Um, Brave Murder Day, Discouraged Ones. These are the only two that don't have any booklets because they released those on Digifax. And, of course, um, here are the four most recent ones right here. I've even had them signed. Uh, Viva Emptiness and Dead End Kings right right there. So that's really, really awesome. I'm very, very happy that they did that. Um, Killer Joe, that's another DVD uh, with um, Matthew McConaughey. It's a pretty cool movie. Uh, King Crimson in the Court of the Crimson King. Kraftwerk. 
Here's a Mad Season right there with the Lane Staley and uh, all the grunge rockers, Mastodon. Morrissey from the Smiths. My Dying Bride, um, Nablus Karis, Neurosis, November's Doom. There's October Tide right there. That's um, uh, I know Jonas Svengse was in that, and uh, I know the Norman Brothers are actually still continuing on with that. So it's definitely very much associated with Catatonia. There's a uh, Paradise Lost right there. Um, I know all the other Paradise Lost albums I have are in the other book, but. Yeah, I'm not going to get into that again. Here's uh, Pink Floyd right here. Continuing on into uh, Division Bell. And of course, Porcupine Tree. Um, the sky moves sideways, light bulb sign, it's in absentia, stuff like that. Incident. Here's uh, Rainbow right here. Uh, Ronnie James Dio and uh, Richie Blackmore. Rush right here, 2112. Um, I forget the name. Farewell to Kings, Moving Pictures. Here's Seal over right here, um, known for songs like Kiss by Rose, Crazy, stuff like that. And of course the Smiths, I love the Smiths, definitely a really great like indie alternative act. This is the first CD that I've ever gotten, like this, this CD's been in my collection for about, I want to say like 11 years, so yeah, it's been a long, long time. I got that from my third grade teacher since I was so fascinated with Igor Stravinsky and uh, it's still there to this day. Um, here is a uh, Tangerine Dream right here. Tears for Fears. Tool right there. Anoma. Lateralis and uh, 10,000 Days. Oliver right here. I love Oliver. The Contropin themes. Blood Inside. Um, Shadows of the Sun. I'm saving the spot right there just in case they release a new one or for something else. Winter Sun, and uh, that's for part two, obviously. And finally, yes, close to the edge, Tales from Topographic Oceans, Relayer, going for the one. I'm planning on getting more Yes albums in the future. I know they're releasing a new one this summer, so I plan to get that. And um, yeah, that's uh, all for the uh, second book. Stay tuned for the last.